What's up people, Dazzles here. It is December, which means that I've got the Christmas holidays coming up, which means I'm gonna have so much time to read and I'm super pumped about that. So let's talk about what I'm planning on reading this month. First of all, I'm going to get around to finishing The Watchmaker of Filigree Street. I kind of got distracted by other projects that I was working on and this one fell a little bit behind. So I'm only what, like 40 pages in. So I want to finish this one off hopefully in the next week or so. So a review coming up soon. The next book I want to make sure I get through is Oathbringer by Brandon Sanderson. It's book number three in the Stormlight Archive. And I think this one's going to be saved when I've got time off work. And I'm just going to hammer through it because it is a big chunky book. And the hardcover is so pretty and I just had to have it. Next up, I want to be getting through another Terry Pratchett book. So I'm going to be reading more. I keep hearing fantastic things about this from a few of my friends. So definitely on the reading list. Plus pretty hardcover as well. So mm. the next one I don't have a physical copy of. But it is Death at Victoria Dock. It's by Kerry Greenwood. And it's book number four in the Miss Fisher Murder Mysteries series. If you didn't know, I do a monthly podcast with Kerry Callaghan and Zoe Michael Stites where we talk about the Miss Fisher series, comparing the books to the episodes if they're related or just talking about a particular book or episode if there's no correspondence between the two. There will be a link down below to the most recent episode of that. So check that out because it's a lot of fun and we have a great time doing it. It's been a few months since I've read something in the Hello series by Kim Harrison. So I'm planning on reading Every Which Way But Dead, which is book number three in Hallows. I'm super pumped because it's just, oh, it's wonderful. A wonderful little series and I want to read it. Now, I think that's just about the right number of books for me to manage to actually read all of them during December. But if I get extra time, I'm going to read Turtles All The Way Down by John Green. It came out a couple of months ago and I've been meaning to get to it, but I've not been reading as much as I wanted to, so it's fallen a little bit behind with higher priorities. And finally, extra, extra bonus, if I happen to get that far and run out of books to read, I want to get through The Goblet of Fire in the Harry Potter series. It's one that I've not read in a good decade or two, so it'll be good to get around to doing that. Yeah. That's my massive reading list I've got planned for this month. I I'm optimistic that I might maybe, if I'm lucky, get through it all, but we'll see how the month goes. I think those two weeks I have off work are really gonna help with that, but I'm not committing to it. It's just this is my this is what I'd like to achieve. And it'll also get me close to like having 40 books read this year, which would be kinda neat. And I'll have to set myself a higher goal next year. If you've read any of these books, let me know down in the comments below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Also, let me know what your reading plans are for the month because I'd love to see what people are reading out there as well. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all in a couple of days where I should be starting a new Nuzlocke challenge, which will hopefully go a little bit better than the last one. I need to read Bulbapedia better sometimes. Mm. That's all from me, and I'll see you in a couple of days. Until then, I hope you're having a great time. Bye.